Another scene that we have dubbed the reflection scene has two parts in it. In the first part, Jameson will approach my character during a fit of terror that he is going through. During the fit of terror, my character rambles things like, they're gonna kill me, which is a reaction to the ritual scene in which he is told that his time is running out. Jameson sits next to my character and tries to comfort him, but my character reflexively moves away, saying, you're gonna kill me. Upon saying this, the lights turn red, which is the same colour as the lighting in a cult scene. The change in lighting represents my character's fight or flight response. He now sees Jameson's character as a threat to his life. Jameson and I will then move to opposite sides of the stage and talk to the audience as if we are talking to each other. After doing this, we will run at each other and whilst grabbing each other, we'll be stuck in a freeze frame that will be interrupted by Luke's character. The lights will turn blue again, showing that my mind has a bit more lucidity than before and also showing that my mind is back in the hospital. It is heavily implied that I just attacked Jameson's character, so Luke's character drags me off the stage, ending part one of this scene. At the moment of recording, we have done a lot less work on part two, but we are planning on it being about Jude's character and Luke's character having a conversation about my character and the events of part one of this scene. Another scene we have created is the monologue scene. In the scene, each character, apart from mine, delivers their own monologue on their thoughts and opinions on the current situation. While one person will be delivering their monologue, the rest would be doing movements inspired by Rashdash choreography classes. These movements are purposely repetitive, and in our case, show the relationships between characters. 